Good morning and welcome back to the channel. So we are in the final episode of the 20 minute crafting challenge with Missy Journals. Um, I think I'm going to continue the 20 minutes, but um, what we're going to do today is we're actually going to make journaling um, pockets, not cards, pockets. But I did want to show you guys this. Um, I was ambitious and seeing if I could do this in 20 minutes. This took me about an hour to do. So I'm not sure if we're going to be able to do something like that. I will continue to try though. So I have a book right here and I'm just going to start ripping out a couple pages. Like this is legitimate from start to finish. So I'm going to glue this down and we're going to fold it in half. And let's try have another one just in case we actually have some time. And you can actually um, sew around these. Obviously, I'm not going to do that because the whole goal here is to try to do as many as you can in 20 minutes. Or just to kind of do what you can, even if it's only one. Because you remember the day that I made the journal? I mean, I only made one. But I still did it in 20 minutes, you know. The goal is to sit down and be able to do something. Feel like you've accomplished something in 20 minutes. Um, so, y'all should see my desk. I'm just saying everything is covered. This is the only clear spot that I have right now, right here. Um, which is incredibly crazy right now. Alright, so I'm just going to set this aside somewhere. Okay, over there works. I'm going to grab some of the lace that I had pre-cut out. Um, we're going to go this way with it. And let's see. I didn't want to pull it down some because I'm going to cut a thingy right here. Actually, let's go ahead and do that. Um, oh, I forgot to grab my punchy thing. Yep. I'm going to go with a two inch circle punch. You could do scalloped, you could do um, whatever shape you want. You could do a different shape altogether. And there we go. All right. So, move you. I seriously need to clean up my desk. <laughs> it is a hot mess. Oh my gosh. Because I've literally just done like one video after the other. It's crazy. And, you know, if the day ended, then I just paused everything in my room and picked it all right back up the very next day, exactly where I left off. So my desk is a hot mess. But isn't that kind of how it is? Like you do a project and your desk is like kind of hurricane craft or whatever. Where did my just throw my oh my gosh I lost my the whole point of me having the giant pen is so I didn't lose it and I literally lost it like what in the world oh I threw it that's why all right so we've sat here and wasted three and a half minutes doing nothing all right let's see Come on, come out. All right, hold that. Give me that. I'm going to lace. I'm going to put it right, right there. We're going to grab one of our doilies. Not that one. Um, actually, we can do new, completely new, and oh wait, because yes, the pre-made stuff definitely works, and it's great for stuff like this, but you can also just design it straight on the card or pocket because we're making pockets today we're not making cards because we've done tags already we didn't 
I don't think we did cards yet. But that is an idea. We can do that. All right. I'm going to put you up here in the corner. All right. I love these tags. They are just amazing. We've got some pre-made embellishments here. I love these because they're super flat. And we can put that right there. And I can throw a doily on myself. And these would be really good in a journal. Or as, you know, um, you can change it all together. And you could do like um, a focal point. Like uh, if you put it on a bag that you're decorating because you're doing loaded bags or something like that. That's super fun, by the way, if you haven't already figured out what a loaded bag is. Oh my gosh, they're so fun. I used to do those all the time. Loaded pockets, loaded bags, loaded folders, the whole nine. So there we go. There's one. All right. Next is this one. Let's grab our punchy punch here. Let's try not to push any buttons. All right. And there we go. And let's do this one here. You could also use different glue. I'm using Fabri-Tac here. It's gluing down the edge over there. It's poking up on me. All right. Um, kind of going to layer this up a little bit. Uh, close this before it freaks out on me. And if you really wanted to, you could um, use like the same set of, like if you're using stickers, you could use the same set of stickers. That way you know everything is going to coordinate. If you're making pockets for a journal, um, if you're making pockets for like a loaded tag, or a loaded book or anything like that. Um, they would all coordinate and go well with each other. Uh, let's see. I've got some of this left, but I don't know if I want to use that or not. That is kind of cute, but it kind of just covers up my, my hole I just punched, which I think is okay. I think that's okay. I'm going to put that right there. Oh, oh, there's a siren going off somewhere. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I can hear it. All right. Could also go this way. I'm not going to do that. Go this way. And we'll lay it down flat. Put some hot glue right here on the back of this string. Let that cool for a second and then smush it out. And then cut it. Okay. And then we can take something else. Let's see, we've got that one. Um, I am so running out of space. Kind of like that instead. But yeah, I think I like that instead. So we're going to. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff everywhere. It's crazy. I know I'm going to hit this mouse. And then it's going to be really fun. I just don't think it would do anything to the video. Alright, we're just going to put glue all over our little plastic piece of here. And I'm using an art glitter glue instead of fabric pack here because it's plastic. And that there. Take the whole kit and caboodle up and get glue all over everything. Okay. 
fish farming. Okay. And there we go. All right. Now I gotta hold that for a moment. Let that pick up. It doesn't pick up quite as fast as Fabricraft does, but that's okay. Because I can't use Fabricraft here. You can probably use hot glue, but oh my gosh, I'm not seeing. All right. So next five minutes, used pressing down to wait for glue. Oh my gosh, it's like not working at all. Come on, grab. There's still glue there. It's just not grabbing. Oh my gosh, this is infuriating. All right, so I'm going to cheat. And we're going to put that. Right there. This is what I do for, um, what's it called? Uh, oops. E6000. I glue it down and then I pin it. All right. So what else are we going to put on here? Um, actually, I don't think we have too many of these left. That's too big, I think. Even if we put it underneath like that, it's still too big. All right. So let's go with another pre-made here. Don't have to use the ones that I made. I bought these to be used. So let's use them. All right. Um, kind of like this over here. And we can put something over here. How about this one? It's pretty. All right, let's do that. Hopefully, this will pick like grab it because I used the art glitter glue on those blings before. I mean, it was on ribbon, not plastic sequins, but I have used it before and it works just fine. I don't know what the deal is today. I think it's because I turned the camera on, I think. If I had to guess, that would be it. All right, and now we're going to take this guy here and load it up with some glue. Put it underneath that one. And there we go. We got ourselves another pocket. All right, are you grabbing at all, dear? Okay, that one finally grabbed. Jeez, Louise. That's crazy. I can't believe that it took so long for it to grab. All right, so we have a third pocket here. Now, what are we going to do with this? All right, we've. right, I'm just going to hold this real quick. Um, we've got this one. I kind of want to cover up this red. Um, I think I can manage it because, I mean, I've covered that almost completely. Um, let's see. I'm just going to set this right over here. Please grab. All right. Um, let's go. We're going to layer this until this is gone. That's what we're going to do. All right, and I've got approximately five minutes left. So, and by the way, how are you guys liking the 20 minute videos? Like I know some of you said that you liked the longer videos. Some of you said you liked the shorter videos. So yeah, tell me what you think. 
I personally love doing the shorter videos. Um, I don't think I can do like journal process videos with you guys because then it would be like, okay, we're going to do this journal process video and all right, this is one out of 45 videos because journals take me days, weeks to do. It is not a short process at all. So I don't know if that is going to be in our repertoire. Ooh, that's cool. Let's do that. And right now I'm just kind of la uh, lacing, layering up some of these laces because they're going to get covered up. But we're layering because we want as much of this red to go away as possible. All right. Plastic, not plastic, squish. All right. And then let's see. All right, so that's not so bad anymore. And there's a little bit of red in here. So let's see, what can we do on this side? I wanna do something but not take away from the focus over here. Um, I really don't know. Oh, we can put a journaling uh, part thing. And I love using black, so that's good. All right. I'm going to put you down right there. Okay. And then we're going to put you down. This one didn't take nearly as much time as I thought it was going to. But we can definitely add to it. I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. It's a little big. And it's just a scrap piece of um, lace anyway. All right, let's layer a little bit more here. Let's go this direction. Yeah, I want to do that piece like that. All right. And all of these laces have holes all in them. So every time I add a new layer, I'm getting the glue, like I'm squishing it down a layer. If that makes sense. I'm not sure if that makes sense, but I hope it does. That's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. There we go. All right. Pull that back up. Hey, I don't need plastic. All right, we got about one minute. Whee. All right, and then we'll put her right there. And there we go. So we've got this pocket here and I'll glue that's in the way. We've got this pocket here that we just did. We've got this pocket here that hopefully the top has finally grabbed. Yes, finally. I love this pocket. It looks like a curtain. And then this is our first one that we did. So they can be super simple, super, you know, basic and minimalistic or really complex and difficult. 
So it doesn't matter. Just take your pick and you can do lots of stuff, especially in 20 minutes. So thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to let me know what you guys are doing in 20 minutes. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.